didn't tell me. Oh, here we go. What's that now? Don't like the cold? Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. Here. Wear this. It belonged to my daughter. Good. Today, I speak your name, girl. Will the goddess speak it back? What will they be naming her, I wonder? Oh, I can't wait to get to the gameplay. Normally it would be the mother who declares. If you had one. The whole village would attend, and matriarchs perform the ritual. But... We are outcasts. Even so, we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. But their wickedness doomed them. To us, we're left the splendors of creation. Beasts of air, water, earth, and steel. So exciting. It is one thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this one day. Now the scenery in this game is beautiful, guys. I swear, it is nice. Hi, Matriarch Tirsa. What is she doing here? Does she mean to forbid the ritual? No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes, you may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you. But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then you honor us. Yes, yes, now go and be ready to declare. Go! That one will know something. Oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name! Aloy! And so it shall be, Aloy. And so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! Ooh. What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough. And you... Blessing its name like it was one I know my duty to the them tribe. and to you. Without consultation, I'm here, and wherever you go, 
I will follow. Oh, so touching. Warning! The following is extremely immature, racist, homophobic, unfunny, stupid, toaster looking, and we'll get the crazy entertainment canceled. Six years later. together aren't you little bast now go and see if you can find some more hmm? well done that's a good boy children come with me She's an outcast to be shunned. Ouch. There. Oh, come on. Water. Rost! Down here! Rost! Rost! He won't hear me. Some kind of cave? Um, I guess this way? Oh, right. I guess follow the light, right? Oh, Jesus. That's... Looks tight, but I can get through. Oh, got a crouch. Okay, nice. This must be a ruin of the metal world. One of the old places. Indeed, it looks like it. Ross said never go in places like this. Mm, he's probably but I right. I have to find a way out. Hmm, what did they do here? You can get out. What's that? Mm, can't do anything. Startling, just a bunch of bats come flying at your face. There's something up ahead. What's that? A dead person. Oh, well, we've been dead There's a long time. Shiny there. Just pull the shiny thing off of a dead person. She was not scared that time. 
that's... Lights. Everywhere. One way to put it. How does it do this? It looks like an MRI machine. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let's go up here. A metal door. Close. Maybe this device I found can help. A shape. It's connected to the door somehow. How to get in. Door changed color too. Open. It did it. So, oh, cool. Okay. Right, it's heck down here now. You think I want it this way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. He's right behind you. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Anything else? Where's that? Oh, I just can't the door. Okay. Oh, there we go. Squeeze through. We'll save. Exploring later. Surely we can come back. Why did they die here? What happened to them? Take my hand. You don't belong down there. Come. Such places are forbidden, Aloy. I fell in. They are of the metal world. What is that on your face? Nothing. Did you find it down there? No. Give it to me. No. Aloy, such things are dangerous. No! <laughs> well, if you're gonna go 
sneaking away from home. You'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. But starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. Ooh. That's exciting. muttering to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. You will need to stay close and do as I say. I know. Now. You're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday. So let's start there. Take this medicine pouch, and I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called mm. South Brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Good. Now eat the berries. <laughs> they may taste bitter, but they can save your life. Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? This valley is just a part of All Mother's embrace. Embrace? The Nor tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All mm, machines tricky. are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Mm. Aloy, a machine's coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. Okay. Tall grass. There. Now stay low. Say the one. No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Keep low, and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Okay, learning to sneak. Oh, another one. Let it pass. Come, back this way. The slower you move, the quieter you'll be. And crouched walking is quieter than upright. Wait for it. Okay. That's the last of them. Let's move on. did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. Is it made of feathers? Ignore him. 
But why is he up there? He's smiling at us. Deb! Get back where you belong! Deb! Where are you? Ignore him. We are outcasts and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. Then he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. There. See them? These are called striders. Ha! Get! Why'd you chase them off? Huh. To show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're best approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Those will do. Follow. Oh, fine. But I want more. Ooh, herbs. Okay, I'm coming. Promise. I've got to shaft it. <laughs> Aloy, come now. I'm coming, damn. There's the herd. All right, it's time to throw some rocks. But rocks can't hurt machines, right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. <laughs> like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with. Or we'll warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy. Unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the Watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. Okay. Oh, shoot. I kind of forgot how to do this. Aloy, throw a rock near me. There we go. Okay. All right. There. Come, girl. It's safe now. I'm just gonna right on down. Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Good. Now, gather stalks of ridgewood from the plants over there. Use the stalks as arrow shafts and metal shards for our heads. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. That's that's let's put those uh, arrows to use. Follow. Here. Stay low in the grass and be quiet. Time to make your first kill, Aloy. Strider. One of the weaker machines. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter if she's careless. You must study your prey. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Like its eye. Can you guess another? on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed me. But that plaything? 
stop playing games. Now, take down that strider. Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to... Aim for the eye! Already did, jerk. Again! Don't fucking screech at me. You did well today. Yeah. But you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy. Quick. Stop telling stories. <laughs> well. I'm not. I can sneak through. You will not. On a mission of stealth with no bow. This is gonna be. I, I need to move slowly, quietly, so I can sneak past. Come on. Let them see me. This isn't sketchy as is. Come on, hurry up. They won't see me. Got to be careful. Okay. Maybe if I throw... There? Oh, but he's about to move. I need to see their path. Rush. 
heck are you, dog? Okay. Stay crossed like you. Okay. There he is. Like, oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. How are you doing this? Does it stop? Yes, yes, it does. Yes, it does. How is this possible? Shh. Do you not understand what stealth means, bro? Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. She, Boy! She saved me. I, I just wanted... Boy! Seal your lips! They are outcasts, both. And she is motherless. Come now. Back to Mother's heart. should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. I know the way. I'd be pretty irritated too. Hmm. Okay, so should we aim for his head, drop the rock, or knock the rock out of his hand? I want to knock the rock out of his hand. my mother. Aloy, I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just hmm. a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? It's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It will be dangerous. How? 
It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me. The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. Oh. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard. And it'll take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Okay. She's very, very eager. Very untrained. <laughs> that bunny got away. I was there to protect. All right. transition beautifully done a little badass right now. He's gotten old. <laughs> Rost! days before the proving and he goes off without me he wouldn't do that or would he all right now let's go find okay try on the training dummies saving okay looking quickly Ooh, nice not what I was aiming at. Alright, cool. Gather some sticks. Does that help? Might as well, right? I don't know. He said we go hunting this morning. Why isn't he here? Where's he gone to? Hmm. Wonder or wonder. What's he doing up there? He's just standing there. What's going on with him?
Aloy, you're here. Okay. Did you want to be alone? No. We must speak. I've been thinking about your training, Aloy. You've learned to hunt, learned to survive. But I fear there's a lesson I failed to teach you. Would you learn it now? Of course. I'll always learn what you have to teach. There has been some trouble recently. It affords an opportunity to learn this lesson, but it will be dangerous. You must come prepared, or you will die. Descend into the embrace, and hunt until you have gathered the parts for fire arrows. Fire arrows? What kind of trouble are we talking about? Once you have the parts, you will meet me there, at the gate beyond the village of Mother's Heart. Uh, the North Gate? At the edge of the embrace? Yes. Now be on your way. Is something else bothering you? No, I'm fine. Are you worrying about what happens after the proving? What happens is clear. You will be accepted as one of the tribe, and I will still be an outcast to be shunned. Rost, even if the tribe accepts me, I won't. There is much to do, Aloy. We will discuss this later. <sighs> okay. Anything else you want me to do while I'm down in the embrace? Oh... Uh, Odd Grotta might be out of food by now. You could hunt a week's worth of meat for her, if you find the time. <sighs> Wouldn't mind, if she'd say thanks just once. <sighs> Grotta follows the law. Her science towards us is honorable, not an insult. If you say so. I'll go gather the parts, but I'm also gonna pay Karst a visit. Aloy. That man breaks the law every time he speaks to you. And I'm glad he does. I want to buy a trip caster, and no other trader will sell to outcasts. Stock it with ammunition, then. You'll find use for that weapon tonight. That sounds ominous. All right. See you at the North Gate. Okay. Okay, now we're tracking for Angreta. Something's Just really bothering him. If he thinks I'm gonna abandon him, he's wrong. Alright, over the map. Okay. Sounds like a bit. Okay. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. The embrace. My whole life I've never gone beyond this valley. That'll change after the proving. Two days. Two days until I get answers. Two days and I'll know who she was. And why I was cast out at birth. As if there could be an excuse for that. Let's go meet Odd Greta. Among the rocks and the trees, but find no sustenance. Hello, Grata. Oh, mother. Since I was cast out, have I not been constant as the river flows? Have I not kept the vows as the stones do? Show me your grace, all mother, and provide for me once more. Don't worry, Grata. I'll hunt your rabbits. Oh, mother, I hear your voice on the wind. I would count your blessings on my prayer beads, but I lost them atop the eastern overlook. My old bones are too worn to return. So it's rabbits and your trinket you need this time. Okay, I'll find you at your camp. Blatantly ignored. Okay. Okay, found some meat. Stop. Mm -hmm. 
Ooh. I forgot how easy it was to aim and shoot on this game. else will help me. Wet. But I tan this leather well. Would you not help me? You want to talk to an outcast? I'm desperate for help. Whatever the consequences. What's the problem then? Trouble with your leg? Forget about me. It's my daughter, Arana. She's in danger. She went after a scrapper near Mother's Cradle, and I fear for her life. Mm -hmm. I can't even stand up, let alone go after her. Will you help me find her? I'll do uh. what I can to help your daughter. Make sure she's all right. I'm begging you. Sure, sure. here okay Grata said her prayer beads were at the eastern overlook it's not far from here oh not oh yep yeah, fall down fall down all the way okay not bad Everyday badass. Real quick, I just want to explain that I skipped about seven to ten minutes. Um, only thing I did was I took down some more machines for one of the quests, and now I'm continuing on with helping Odd Greta. Looks like I got some machines. Brave to trail of the rocks is close by. Out, but it takes strong arms to reach the overlook the fast way. All right. 
Let's do this. I was gonna fall. I'll let them go this time. This looks promising. Aha! Grata's prayer beads. I see why she comes up here to pray. It looks out to Mother's Gate. You know, I wonder what bothers me more. That she ignores me, or that with all her talking to all mothers, she's not alone. Look at that. The scenery is so freaking nice. Get right up. There's Grata, all alone with All Mother. The only way she knows. Good news, Grata. Once again, All Mother has brought you rabbits. I found your prayer beads too. Just try not to lose them again. All Mother. Each morning I find your tears of joy speckling the leaves. Joy at the beauty of all you have made. See how I cry now with you. In gratitude. So you'll cry for her, but you won't speak to me. Fine. Guess that makes you the better outcast. Interesting. Grata, I may not be around much for a while. I'm gonna run in the proving, and I'm not sure what's gonna happen after that. Oh, mother. I thank you for the kindnesses you share. When the proving comes, in your great wisdom, may you give favor to a brave of generous heart. I think I get what you're saying. Goodbye, Grata. For now. Hmm. Oh, Mother. Hear me as I count off my years of devotion. Alright, I don't want to listen to you with that. Alright. So now I'm gonna go talk to this person for a trip caster. Brom! It's your sister, Olara! And there's the rain. What the heck? Mm, I'll go gather this class. Who are you calling out for? Do you need help? I have nothing against outcasts. Far from it. But I shouldn't talk to you. I don't want to get in trouble. I don't see anyone else around to help. I guess you're right. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to be callous. My brother was cast out, but his sentence has ended. He, he should have come home, but he didn't. And, and his camp was covered in blood. Okay. I'll do what I can to find your brother. You will? Then let me come with you. I won't be a bother. I know how to stay out of sight. I'm faster on my own. If that is how it must be, just find him then, please. Oh, okay. Let's get a quest. So it goes, goes back. Sounds like she's in trouble. Pretty badass if you don't. Okay. Give me a second, let me loot all of them. Can I talk to you for a minute? Oh, there she is. Okay. 
Then let's and now Thank you. I thought those watchers were gonna tear me apart. Your father sent me after you. It's time to go home. I figured. But I can't go back until I get my mother's spear from that scrapper. I'll look for your spear. You will? Oh, thank you. Go find your father. His leg gave out while he was searching for you, just south of Mother's Heart. Oh, no. Okay, I'll go to him right away. Thanks again. You know, for people who aren't supposed to be talking to her, they sure as hell talk to her a lot. Oh. Verona's trail ends here. Must be where she saw the scrapper. If I follow okay. its tracks, I should be able to find that spear. Be cursed and get a trip caster. Okay. Mm, winter time and walking through water. Always fun. All right. Let's go and take care of these scrappers. There. Time to get that spear. A well-made weapon. Arana will be happy to have it back. Right, is that everything? I think so. Oh. Oh, I don't know. Perk waiting. Yes, I'll be waiting for him. There he is. No, oh, okay. Nervous. Well, well, well. An outcast on my doorstep. All mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. <coughs> Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. It's always a pain in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. <laughs> okay. Last time I visited, you had a trip caster available for trade. Still got it? I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrapper lens. What can I say? Special weapons don't come cheap. Oh, I can pay. Took down a scrapper not long ago. Stripped out the lens in perfect condition. I'll be the judge of that. Show me. I guess it's a good thing I was taking down scrappers, I guess. Equip. Hmm. It's got a roadcaster. Warbow. Oh. It's got such good stuff, but I only have so many shards. Now that you've got yourself a trip caster, practice how to use it someplace else, all right? My life's exciting enough without a bunch of shock wire booby traps to trip over. <laughs> really? Could have fooled me. <laughs> hmm. Will you be around later in case I want to make another trade? I'll be here. Same as usual, bring me the parts you harvest from any machines you hunt. The better the parts, the more shards I'll pay. Be sure to take a close look at my inventory, though. Who knows? Maybe I've got something that could give you an edge in the proving. Okay. I'm gonna buy that rope caster. Never know. Could come in handy. Another day, 
Another trade. Okay. okay. I guess that concludes our business. All right. Bye. See you around. I've got what I need. Time to meet Rost at the North Gate. Okay. All mother be praised. Aloy's back with the spear. First you send Arana back to me, and now you've got the spear. When I first called out to you for help, I didn't even know if you'd speak to me. I'm glad you did. Me too. I can't believe you got the spear back. Your mother knew how to craft them. It's of exceptional make. I'll never be the crafter she was, but she did pass along a few tricks. I'd be happy to take a look at your spear. Thank you. It sounds like she was special. I'm sorry for your loss. Well, because of you, I still have the spear to remember her by. You didn't have to help us, but you did. She would have admired that. Thank you, Aloy, for everything. Mm -hmm. Cool. So, I just want to explain real quickly, um, because of how jinky recording on the PlayStation 4 is, I accidentally did not record, like, 30 minutes or something like that. Um, so I did these two tutorials. I did the trip caster tutorial and the rope caster tutorial. Um, before that, I had done the the forgotten. I talked to Brome. I tracked him down, so on and so forth. I pretty much said he was a um, a danger to others, so he decided to uh, stay on his own, and his sister just wants time alone. Who knows? Probably will never talk to those people again. So, um, I spent skill points as well. I am like, as you can tell, I have six of them all selected. Um, I'll probably just keep going straight over until I have them all collected. So, now that I've explained that, we will get straight into the next part of the story. Let's go learn last lesson from Rost. Opening a gate for an outcast? Some who are shunned reaped honor before disgrace. Okay. <sighs> so much for tribal law. I spoke to no one, and now we must both keep silent, for we are outside of the embrace. These are the true wilds, Aloy. With threats unlike any you have ever faced. That carcass? Oh, what sort of beast was that? The tribe calls it a sawtooth, and it's something new, something angry. Since they first started appearing ten years ago, they have killed many braves. Yeah. Okay, follow the path of destruction. Follow the path. It's not far. That cabin, what happened to it? A machine, that's what. What sort of machine does that? The sort of machine you're hunting now. Oh. I see. I'll watch your carcass. I'll harvest the parts. Watch your surroundings. Mm. Farther now. Why are we the only ones out here tonight? Why can't the tribe's birds hunt this machine? They did. The kills we've passed are theirs. And tomorrow, they will hunt again. They won't need to. 
This machine will be my kill. Or your death, if you're not careful. Okay. They're all silent. Hush. An entire lodge? Wrecked? By... Sawtooths? How many were there? I didn't bring you here to answer questions, Aloy. I brought you here to deal with that. Ooh. Kill a larger machine. Side. This hunt is yours to make, Aloy. Yours alone. No matter what happens, I will not intervene. You understand? You are on your own. Hmm. I should stay out of sight. I can use the tall grass to approach. Okay, let's see. Where can I place my traps? Have ammo for this weapon. Yeah, you do. Not expecting to kill it with one hit. Like that. Because I did a lot more damage than I thought. Why did I bring you here? Not to answer questions. Aloy. Survival requires perfection. It was a test to hone my skills against a dangerous new machine. No. Follow. Confusion. These are Nora hunting lands. They must be protected. If you hadn't destroyed the Sawtooth, how many braves might it have killed or injured tomorrow? The lesson lives within the question, Aloy. For years, you've trained to win the Proving, but only for yourself. As a brave, it will be your duty to fight for your tribe. My tribe? <laughs> you said I wouldn't need them. But I never said the tribe wouldn't need you. The strength to stand alone, Aloy, is the strength to make a stand. To serve a purpose greater than yourself. That is the lesson you must learn. And remember it. After the proving. And after I'm gone. 
Hmm. We're finished here. Follow. Dawn has passed. This will be your last day in the embrace as an outcast. Use the time to set your mind on the challenges before you. When it is time for you to go to Mother's heart, I'll be waiting for you along the way. I understand the final lesson, Rost. Do you? But if I'm going to stand for something, it'll have to be something I believe in. Then I hope you find it, Aloy. I hope you do. I'll go back to the cabin with you. I'm not heading there just yet. I have other plans. Oh. Such as? I'll be waiting for you when it is time. I'll see you at Mother's Heart then. You will. Thank you.